Hey, what's going on, uh, Lance? Congratulations, man. Thank you, thank you. Hey, man, you're not a person who show a lot of emotion. You pretty much straightforward into the hip. But after the final horn went off, man, it's just like the floodgates going up. Des describe that feeling after you after you finally was champion and named MVP, man. For me, it's been a journey. I mean, coming from a different school and just having to put my trust into a whole nother organization and the guys just having my back and we end up champs. I mean, what can I say? <laughs> Danielle? Seems like you're a little almost like emotionally exhausted right now. Is that fair to say? Yeah, I mean, this feeling is unreal. If you'd have told me we'd have, we were in NIT champs at the end of the seat at the beginning of the season, I probably would have told you you was lying. But now that we are, it's just it's an amazing feeling. It does there today in the last few games and believed that you could win this thing. Was there a turning point where you you felt that that belief really started to grow? Probably not in this tournament. It was probably a couple of games ago, maybe even a little bit more, a little further back when we lost to SMU at SMU. I think that was kind of the clicking point for us. It was like we need, we wanted that win so bad that just the next couple of games that we just was going to put our heart into it and let the chips fall where they may. Jason? Hey, Landers. Um, Penny said earlier that the NIT is just the start. And I asked, uh, I'll ask you the same thing I asked Lester. Is there any part of you that's, um, you know, letting yourself look ahead? Does, does a win like this, does an accomplishment like this um, make you, uh, like, look ahead to the future at all about what, uh, what, next season could be like if everybody, um, you know, comes back and, and, and goes on? I mean, right now we probably all still hear the buzzer ringing in our head and just looking at the score in the maze. Like, so we're going to go home and enjoy this win. And later, maybe a week or so, we'll talk about it as a team without the coaches, um, making a family decision like his brothers, like to see what we're going to do. 